morning, Bumblebeezies. Happy Wednesday. It is 7.30 and I'm just getting ready. You know that summer is here because the shower water is hot. <laughs> like you literally just turn it on like the slightest amount and it's already hot. So I have it like all the way to the right because I want it to be colder and it's still like not even cold. Anyways, you guys, I'm sure you guys have seen that Dim Tai Fung is open at Downtown Disney. We have reservations for this Sunday. So I'm excited. And we were watching some videos. Well, Papa Bear was watching videos on YouTube of someone eating there. I think it's someone he follows, I'm not sure, but I think that their prices are actually higher at the downtown Disney location. And it's actually just going to be the three of us, me, Papa Bear, and Sebastian, because AG and Vanessa have work and we couldn't like find a time where they would both be off. Like when I was looking at reservations, it just wasn't going to work out. So just the three of us. And then there's this new spirit jersey that I want. Um, maybe you've seen it. It has like different characters on the back. And it actually looks like a spirit jersey that people would like paint. I don't know if you guys follow like, like if you've ever seen it on Instagram or like just online on TikTok or whatever, like people would hand paint like the letters on the back to be like different characters for each letter. That's totally what it looks like like they clearly took that idea and they were like well since you guys are painting our spirit jerseys we might as well make them too and start selling them and when papa bear went there well first when the kids went there on pride night they tried looking for it and because i think it came out like the day before that and they couldn't find any and then papa bear went the next day on wednesday and they didn't have any and then i think they restocked literally the next day and i saw someone post yesterday that they had them at world of disney i'm just hoping that they have them when we go on sunday because you guys know it sells out so fast i have been absolutely loving this <laughs> it's the um elf skin woe glow yeah this is like my new favorite you guys and i have this other spf from la roche posay this one, I like this one too, but I just like this better, like a little bit better. So yeah, these are like my new go-tos for sunscreen for my face. But this, you guys, I love. And I'm really weird with sunscreen for my face because I actually love the scent of sunscreen. And this has just a slight scent of sunscreen. Like it's there, you can smell it for sure, but it, I don't think it's as strong of a scent as like body sunscreen or sunblock. Um, so I love it. But yeah, I'm really weird. I love the smell of sunscreen. It makes me feel like I'm on a vacation. I've always been that way. I don't know if that's weird, but I just love the scent. I love the smell of sunscreen. So yeah, I love that. I took off my nails, you guys. And anytime I take my nails off, I feel like really weird. <laughs> but I'm gonna let them rest for a little bit and then I'll probably redo them in a couple of weeks. Let's make some coffee. Let's go with this mug today. This one is also from Disneyland. This looks really old. Like I have no idea when I got this, but I don't know, like the design, it just looks older. I wish they would have the years. 
I filled it all the way up with ice. And then we have the Duncan Cold. I like these cake cups, but I don't know like if I would buy them all the time. They are very convenient though if you like to drink iced coffee. So today I'm going to try it with heavy cream and some syrup and I'm gonna do cookie dough today. I'm gonna add a tablespoon of the heavy cream and then a tablespoon of the skinny syrup. Okay. That's really good. I like that a lot. We're gonna make some meatloaf for dinner. I can still remember the first time that we kissed. Feeling light as a feather. I always wanna feel like this. But at some point, we miss a kind of sugar. dinner so you guys saw I made this earlier meatloaf and I made it because AJ had to go to work he starts at three so that's why I made the dinner that way he can just take it and then these are smashed potatoes I just need to put these in the oven and crisp them up I did already make some for AJ that way he could take it he just left so yeah I had some on this tray but anyways Sebastian took like a really long nap and he just woke up so um it's like almost kind of, I mean, it's kind of almost dinner time. If you think about it, we have like two and a half hours until dinner because we usually eat at 5, 5.30, sometimes 6. But today dinner's going to be early. T today dinner's going to be ready early. So since it's getting close to dinner, I'm not going to give him any lunch because he slept like right through lunch. He had his bottle, which is good enough. But I am going to give him a little snack. So he's going to have some blueberries. Here are the potatoes. I just put these in the oven for like 30 minutes until they're nice and crispy. Then I also steamed up some asparagus and then you guys already saw the meatloaf. Trader Joe's. I feel like this is new. Oven dried red and yellow bell pepper crisps. But I don't think I like that. I'm not sure. We're gonna get these Dutch griddle cakes. I heard it's like the um, like the bun of a McGriddle. So we're gonna give that a try. Let's try this super strawberry sorbet. 
mini shrimp bao. Is this new? I think this is new, Papa. Mini shrimp bao. This is also new. They have a seafood boil, so we'll we'll get one of these. We'll try it out. It's only ten dollars. We're back from Trader Joe's, so we're gonna do a haul. We got all of everything in here. The first thing that we got is this cheesecake kringle. We got the mini shrimp bao buns. Hey, where are you going? Come back. We got some kimchi. This we did try already, but we really like it, so we grabbed another bag. It's the Korean rice ball with plant-based beefless bulgogi and vegetables. That's what that looks like. And then ube mochi, the ice cream. We're going to try this again because I can't remember if I like that or not. Okay, and then I found the seafood boil. I was trying to find this the last time we were there, but they didn't have it. We got some japchae. This is new, the bubble waffles. Bubble waffles. So yeah, I'm excited to try this. And then the calamari, the crispy battered calamari. We picked up two of the ice cream sandwiches that the kids like. We also picked up the super strawberry sorbet. We're gonna give that a try. And then you guys already saw I showed this earlier, the Dutch uh, griddle cakes. Mm -hmm. 